2023 NBA draft is finally done. And the main name that we constantly hear is Victor Wembanyama. No doubt, he probably will be the best player in this draft class. In fact, he's probably going to be a star. But who are the other guys in this draft class that are going to be stars? Who are the guys that we may actually be sleeping on in this draft class? Well, you know what? I give you three. Let's get to it. Ben Shepard, drafted out of Belmont by the Indiana Pacers, number 28th overall. Ben Shepard is six foot six, weighing in at just at 190 pounds. With that size, he can defend multiple positions. He can guard on the perimeter. He can guard in the post. And he can do a little bit of everything on the floor offensively as well. And that's because he's fully polished. He spent four seasons at Belmont where he averaged 19 points per game and five rebounds and three assists last season. And each and every season at Belmont, his scoring went up and his steals went up per game. So we definitely see a fully polished player in Ben Shepard. Our second sleeper in this draft class is Imani Bates. Imani Bates from East Michigan, who was drafted by the Cleveland Cavaliers, number 49 overall. Bates is six foot nine. He has a very small and, and thin body frame. So you can't expect him to, to bang down low with your fours and your fives, but he's definitely going to be able to guard one through three easily with no problem. He's long, he's linky, so that size right there will definitely make up for his lack of weight. And, and, and Bates is a guy who averaged 19 points a game last season along with five rebounds. He's He's a pure scorer, to say the least. He he does a lot of his damage on the perimeter, but he can take you off the dribble and attack the basket as well. Imani was projected to really be a top five pick, but, you know, things just didn't go well for him at Memphis, and, and that's the first go round. But then he got transferred to East Michigan and got the first start, and he looked like the player that we all expected him to be. I think the Cleveland Cavaliers got a, a still here, uh, quite a, a gem drafting him at 49 because he may very well be a starter by the end of the season and last but not least there's a player who was drafted in the lottery late lottery that is um he's a, a player who fits the mold he, who fits him very well in today's nba and that's jordan hawkins out of uconn who was drafted by the new orleans pelicans He's a cousin of Angel Reese, and many know who that is. And and this guy is a winner just like she is. You know, he, he can shoot the lights out. He's a pure scorer, and he's just going to fit in today's game extremely well. And at the end of the day, um, Victor Wimbanyama, he's the star of this draft. He's the one who's being talked about. But the fit is just too well for Jordan Hawkins. And he could very well, he could very well be rookie of the year. He could very well be the best player in this draft class. And we can expect a lot of things from Jordan Hawkins. And he may be the star of this draft class. 